In the women's strawweight division at Dana White's Contender Series, you got Julia Polastri, Brazilian, coming in at 3-0, taking on Patricia Alugis, who comes in at 9-2. And, and this is going to be an excellent fight. And to me, just peeking at it, it should be an easy one to predict. But let's get into it first. Alugis is 2 inches taller at 5'4". We know more about Polastri. She's 25 years old, 63-inch reach, fights right-handed, 4.3 significant strikes per minute. Uh Zero takedowns right now, so no average uh, on the takedowns. Um, in her 11 wins, four by KO, two by submission, five by decision. Now, she does have three losses, but you got to go back to 2021 since the last loss, and that was against a UFC fighter named Jasmine Jazuda Vicious, right? That came at the Contender Series. So since then, she's run off three more wins in a row. Basically, if you take away the Contender Series, she's won about eight or nine fights in a row, and the last two were at LFA. Uh, and both were wins by TKO and submission. So LFA is a decent promotion uh, compared to some of the other promotions these fighters are coming out of. Now, Illusions fighting from Paraguay, right? Nine wins, two losses. She's won her nine fights by four KOs, uh, two submissions, and two decisions. She hasn't lost since 2017, right? But she hasn't been that active either. Only one fight since 2019, and that came uh, at Copa Team four is five so this one seems to me like they're trying to throw Palastri a softball here uh, in a way they can get her a win and get her into the UFC because she's won so many fights in a row just and, and now you know as time moves on it's like okay she lost to a UFC fighter but she's won every other fight uh, for a long time now and she's much more active so I just don't see an angle here for illusions to win maybe I'm missing something but I like Palastri to win this fight and she's Brazilian that solidifies it even more for me. Just based on everything else, you throw that in there as well, forget about it. Palashi wins, in my opinion, easily. I like to see a first round KO finish or submission here for her to move to 12 and 3, women's strawweight division. Dana White's contender series.